Leon Edwards and Kamara Usman first met on December 19, 2015. Usman, who was 28 years old at the time, had just won the Ultimate Fighter season 21, so this was his UFC debut. Leon, who was 24, had already had three fights in the UFC, losing his debut via split decision to Claudio Silva. He then came back and got an eight second KO over Seth Basinski, and then he got a decision win over Powell Porlak. The first fight was close, but Usman's wrestling was the difference maker. Kamaru ended up winning a unanimous decision. Guys, please do me a massive favor, hit that subscribe button if you're enjoying the content, I'd really appreciate it. From here, both guys would go on incredible runs. Kamaru would go and win another 13 fights in a row, claiming the welterweight title and that number one pound for pound spot. Leon went on a 10 fight on beaten streak, just staying consistent, chipping away over the years until he finally gets a title shot. It would just happen to be that when Leon does finally get that title shot all those years later, it would be against the man he last lost to seven years prior. Leon's nickname as Rocky, and for how his story would unfold, it couldn't be more fitting. August 20th, 2022, UFC Usman versus Edwards. The fight starts and Leon has an amazing first round. He ruins Usman's 100% takedown defense. He takes him down in the first round and he gets him in a rear naked choke. Rounds two, three, and four, Usman's in control. It looks a lot like the first fight. And at the end of the fourth round, Leon goes back to his corner and his coach, Dave Lovell, had this to say. Listen, stop feeling sorry for you. Oh, well, come on then. What's wrong with you? You're too now. You gotta pull the out of fire. Stay short. Come on, Leon, man. You got it, man. Come on. You got this. Sharp shoot on this. Yeah. Come on, Leon. Sharp shoot. Let's go. You had him, man. Can you do it again? Okay. The fifth round starts and it's looking a lot like the previous three. And then... Oh, no! Declaring the winner by knockout and... Describe what this feels like. I can't put it into words, Joe. It's been a long, long four, four, four years. Don't doubt to me I couldn't do it. The all said I couldn't do it. Look at me now. Dave Lovell's speech to Leon going into the fifth, the head kick landing, and Leon's post-fight interview, absolute goosebumps. It was one of the biggest upsets in UFC history. 56 seconds left on the clock in a fight that he was 100% going to lose. Leon breaks Usman's nine year, 19 fight unbeaten streak. He takes away his number one pound for pound spot and his world title with one beautifully timed head kick. A real rocky ending. The rematch is set for March 18th at UFC 286. This time it's gonna take place in Leon's backyard in London. The last fight took place in Utah and it was at elevation. Leon cites this as the reason he was flat in rounds two, three, and four. So hopefully this time Edwards has an even better performance. It's gonna be a very close fight. It can't be denied that Usman was winning 90% of the last fight, so naturally going into the rematch, Leon is an underdog. I think the biggest question is, how is Kamaru gonna look after that kind of knockout? Is he gonna be tentative on the feet, a bit hesitant to strike? Is his chin gonna be the same? Sometimes after a brutal KO like that, a fighter is just not the same again. But we've got no way to know until March 18th. I'm gonna be doing a final prediction and breakdown for UFC 286 for next week. So look forward to that. Please comment down below and let me know how do you think the fight's gonna go and subscribe if you enjoy MMA content. Thank you so much.